Keir Starmer, the man who promised to lead with integrity and unite Labour, is now making decisions that are starting to resemble a dictatorship. Ever since becoming Prime Minister, Starmer's grip on the party and the government has only tightened. But now, his latest shocking move has his own MPs up in arms. The first red flag? Starmer's controversial decision to cut winter fuel payments for millions of pensioners. Even after Labour MPs begged him to reconsider, Starmer ignored their warnings. This wasn't a one-off. He's showing a disturbing pattern of leadership, and it's about to escalate. Now, insiders are leaking news of a potential cabinet purge. The first casualty? Transport Secretary Louise Hay. Earlier this month, she openly criticised P&O ferries, which almost cost the UK £1 billion in investment. Starmer is reportedly furious over the financial hit, and whispers within the cabinet suggest that Hayes' days are numbered. A senior official even hinted, if there's a reshuffle tomorrow, I think she'll be gone. But that's not where the drama ends. The real question on everyone's mind, what about Angela Rayner? For the past three years, Rayner and Starmer have been locked in a cold war within Labour. Back in 2021, Starmer tried to force her out, but couldn't finish the job. Now that he's Prime Minister, the tension is still simmering. Rayner also spoke out against P&O ferries. So the big question is, will Starmer come for her next? With Starmer's growing reputation for cutting down those who defy him, Rayner could very well be on the chopping block. But can Starmer really afford to go to war with his own deputy? But here's the bigger problem. This isn't just about Starmer's feud with his own ministers. It's about his leadership style. He's acting more and more like a leader who doesn't tolerate dissent, ignoring MPs, pushing policies without debate and possibly preparing to sack high-ranking ministers for minor missteps. Starmer's leadership is taking a dangerous turn. But let's be clear, this kind of authoritarian control could backfire. Labour voters are already starting to question his leadership and if this continues, Starmer could face nationwide outrage. The British public won't tolerate a Prime Minister who silences his own party to push through controversial decisions. What do you think? Has Keir Starmer crossed the line with his dictator-like behaviour? Will he push Labour into turmoil? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you agree that Starmer's leadership is going too far, don't forget to like this video and hit subscribe for more explosive political updates.